Previously on Timestorm. The cultural event the library is organizing at Branch Brook Park. We're all going together. It's a big deal for the library. April's a busy month at the park with all the cherry mm-hmm. blossom events. Well, they're in full bloom. So your attendees will have a lovely view as they walk around. You're really interested in that wall. Before, there was some kind of... What? Nothing. Hey, Benny. The huge hanging wall art thingy? It was gone. Whatever was hanging there, it it, it must have been taken down. But why? It's such a bulky tapestry. I'm sure it wasn't easy taking it down and hiding it so quickly. It was a close call, Josie. We've got to replace that doorknob as soon as possible. We just helped a cacique learn his lines for an areito. Witness. Find. The number. Showing us that we all belong Horacio, Alexa, and Benny Take back time, find history in the time storm Witness, find, remember Puerto Rico continues to experience school closures and recurring energy blackouts. Government officials are calling for a count of the death toll, as the accuracy of the previous numbers is being called into question. Aye. Those official numbers never made any sense. We'll continue to bring you updates as the situation unfolds. What's up with you two? I'm just reading about Aguaybana on my phone. Me too! Did you know that Aguaybana the first, the leader of Puerto Rico when Juan Ponce de Leon arrived? Aguaybana welcomed him into the village and they were friends at first! Or that after Aguaybana the first died in 1510, his brother, he led an army to fight against the Spanish, but he was killed by Ponce's men in the Taino Rebellion of 1511. Uh, ooh, okay, uh, let's see. I remember something about a cacique. But I didn't know any of that other stuff. Uh, Isn't it kind of messed up how we never learned anything about these brothers before? Right? Like, don't their lives count? Hello there, Janelle. Hey, Josie. Huh. Thanks for your help. I really appreciate the lock change on such short notice. Yeah, 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 yeah sure thing. Uh, hey, hey, you want me to lock the door now? Oh, no. Uh, you can go ahead and leave it open. Thanks again. Yeah, n- n- no, no problem. Hey, Datu. What's going on? Hi, Janelli. Nothing serious. Just fixing a lock. Lock? Yeah. I should go update Josie now that it's done. Janelle, do you want to join our game? Uh, yeah, sure thing. Here's a character card, dice, and a player piece. You can play as the rogue. Uh Uh-huh. Sure. The rogue. This is going to be amazing. Good. They they can't know where I live. Hello? Janelle? You just rolled a dice. Now. My feet lies in your hands, Janelle. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. What did you say? It's your turn. Ooh, Gaze of the Beholder. I love this game. I'll be right back. I'll join the next round. Hey, Josie. Uh, what's going on? The, the lock was broken, so we had it replaced. That's it? Nothing else? No. Okay, I have to ask. Do you live inside the store? <laughs> Where? In this tiny office? Uh, uh, I don't know. Maybe like an apartment. You know, attached to the store. (laughs) Does it look like there's an apartment tucked away anywhere? Uh... You think these walls are hiding a secret door. (laughs) No, I 
I, I guess not. I don't know what I was thinking. What is this? A solar-powered light cube. They were a big help during blackouts after Hurricane Maria. Kind of looks like an origami balloon. Uh, yeah. Guess I'll get back to that game. Who are you? Oh, uh, the rogue. Ah, it's always fun being the rogue. The cherry blossoms are so pretty! Hey Alexa, remember when you climbed up one of those trees and Ba had to oh. carry you down? Hey Fanny. <laughs> well, you bring this up every time we come to the park. I bet I'd have no problem climbing those trees now. Ramiro, kids! Hey Hi, Regina. Regina. Hi, hi, hello. Sorry, I've been running all over the place. There's still so much to do. Uh, Bettina, have you seen Clara? Last I saw her, she was by the octagon shelter. Ramiro! found her. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait for you kids to hear all the musicians we have lined up. Clara? Hi, Angie. Hey there, everyone. Welcome to Branch Brook Park. Sorry to interrupt. Is everything all right? The reggae musicians are asking for another power strip. I brought extra power strips. I'll take care of this. I need to greet the mayor and set him up for his opening remarks. Clara, go take care of things and I'll take the twins to look at the cherry blossoms while the musicians warm up. Ay, gracias, Ramiro. I'll catch up in a bit. You might want to walk along the Lenape Trail. Just follow those little yellow blazes. You see that one in the tree there? Oh, yeah, I see it. Walk in that direction, and you'll find more painted marks to follow. I never even noticed those yellow spots. Plenty of cherry blossoms along the way. Enjoy your visit. Bueno, let's go follow this Lenape Trail. Ready for another round of our favorite game? Guess the year! <laughs> All right, I'm ready at the bay. What do you got? All right. First moment from Puerto Rico's past in the windshield in three, two, one. The Libertad Puerta! Come on, this one's easy. That's the pirate Cofresi. And judging by how he's running through the brush, this is right after he abandoned his ship, the Anne, in 1825, the year he was captured. Let's give you something a little more challenging. Las Cuatro Veintinueve. That was a long case clock, right? I'm not saying anything. It was a long case clock. The one in La Fortaleza. The game is guess the year, not the location, Lieutenant. I know, I know. I happen to remember a certain Ricardo de Ortega striking a long case clock with his sword, stopping the clock, and marking the exact time Spain lost control over Puerto Rico right before the United States invaded in... 1898! Good job! Another? Please. 4,645! 4,645! 4,645! 4,645! What? Wait, what, what's this? You weren't supposed to... No. What, was that the Rio Piedras massacre? No, that, that, that was in 1935. Could it have been the UPR student strikes in 2010? No, that's not it. It was... Mardi Gras in New Orleans. I know the streets of Viejo San Juan, Natabe. You're right, Lieutenant. It was a protest in Puerto Rico. What year? I can't tell you the year. Enough! I've had enough of your rules. I'm stuck inside the time storm. I can never go back to Earth. The, the least... Tell me the answer to this silly game. 2019. 2019? But, but the twins are in 2018. I've never seen past. You've never seen past the twins present. You're not supposed to. Oh, 
time, Mito. When was the last time we went salsa dancing? Uh, too long. Two, two, three, six. Forget about counting it out, Rami. Just feel the rhythm. Ramiro, Clara, you two are such good dancers. Thanks, Bettina. No, no, it's all Clara. She makes me look good. She doesn't even make a face when I step on her feet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Rami. <laughs> I better go see if anyone needs anything. Can you check in with the twins? Sure thing. This is amazing! It reminds me of the baby naming ceremony with the musicians circling around the dancers. It's kind of like the areto, too, in a way. I mean, the instruments and the rhythms are different, but still, it feels like they're all related. Related across time! Wepa! Hey, look at you two! <laughs> Come on, Pa! I no more dancing. You know I have no rhythm. Who cares? Let's go! Ah. <laughs> Come on! Hey, hey. It's a little faster, Pa! Not okay! Hey. Not, 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 not. Hey. 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 assist again, Datu. Of course. I think I'll leave the tapestry up now that the lock is fixed. I better get back to the other store. It's, it's getting late. Hey, Josie, do you have anyone helping you at the other store, I mean? Well, no, but, but I get by, you know. I was I... just wondering, because if you ever needed help, I'd be willing. Oh, I appreciate it, Datu, but the location... Right, right, right. The, the location, right. And it's just, I don't know if, like... Oh, oh no, I get it. It must be difficult, of course. All the back and forth. It's not like a door. You know that, right? There are rules, steps that you have to take. <sighs> you know what? Maybe we could test it out. Really? Help me lock up. So, stand in front of the tapestry. Now, place your hands on where the design appears 3D. Here on this archway? Whoa. Yeah. You're going to feel a sort of electrical current. It'll feel strange, like you're outside of your body for a few seconds. But considering what's happening, it's, it's understandable. How does this work? Electricity. Here. A solar-powered light cube. I'll go first so you know what to do. There is one more thing, a word you have to say. A word? Locus. <gasps> Josie? Wow. Oh, she really did disappear. Not disappear, she traveled. And now it's my turn. All right, Datu, you got this. Locus. <gasps> oh! You're here! It worked! What do you mean it worked? Were you expecting it not to? I've never let anyone use the tapestries to travel through the vortex before. Tapestries? Look back at the wall. Oh, that's almost identical. Identical to the one that's hanging on the office wall in Newark. I wow. finally have someone to share my secret with! But you told me about traveling between the two stores months ago. Having someone know about it is different than someone traveling with me. I can't believe that we traveled all this way in an instant. Where are we exactly? Old San Juan, Puerto Rico. Welcome to the other Taino comics and games. Amazing. There's still a lot of renovating that needs to happen. But but that's true of a lot of the businesses here. Remember, it's it's only been seven months since Hurricane Maria. Wow. This is some heat and humidity. It really reminds me of home. Home? Oh, the Philippines. I remember as a kid going on walks with my Lolo and Lola on nights just like this. I loved gazing up at the stars with them. 
Oh, yeah? Follow me. Where are we going? It's not the Philippines, but a few blocks away, in front of El Moro, the fort, there's a wide open field where we can stare at the stars. Did you two have fun? Yes! The bomba tent was the best! I loved the dancing, and Benny even got to play the barrel drum! I saw that. You weren't half bad, Benny. Yeah. That Lenape trail was cool, too. Can you believe it starts here in Newark and goes all the way to South Mountain? Wow, that's over by West Orange and Milburn. You're not supposed to walk it all in one day, though. That'd be a really, really long walk. Right, Benny? Yeah. But not a long drive. (laughs) Rami, where are you going? This isn't the way home. I heard South Mountain and thought we could take a ride up to look at the stars. I would never have guessed that those were frogs. Tree frogs. Coquis. Tiny, loud ones. (laughs) They don't have those in the Philippines. I need to take more time to do things like this. I never thought that tonight I'd be looking out at the night sky in Puerto Rico. It really does remind me of the Philippines. Must be something about islands, huh? Yeah. Thank you, Josie. Thank you for bringing me here. Alexa, Benny, zip up your jackets. It's chilly. Look. Check out this sky. Wow. It's even nicer than I imagined. New moon, clear skies. This is perfect for stargazing. Okay, what's up? You hardly talked the whole car ride over. I wonder what the twins are whispering about. Hey, do you ever look at our kids and think they're just amazing? (laughs) All the time. Oh, Rami... This was the perfect end to the night. This episode was written by Andrew Cianes de la O, with story and direction by me, Dania Ramos, with audio engineering, sound design, and original music by Michael Aquino. The role of Alexa Ventura was played by Leilani Figueroa. Benny Ventura was played by Claudio Venancio. Ramiro Ventura was played by Walter F. Rodriguez. Clara Ventura was played by Jenica Carmona. Janelli was played by Frances Ramos. Josie was played by Angelica Uviera. Datu Enchera was played by Joel Arandia. Horacio Mendez was played by Orlando Seguera. Agave was played by Alicia Rivas. Bettina was played by Amanda Faison. Angie was played by Jane Mandel. This episode also featured Trevor Brown, Florence Faison, Daniela Palacios, and Gary Kai Fletcher. The featured guest musician was Luis Diaz. Additional original music by Davis Garcia and O.Y. Maldonado. Timestorm is produced by Cocotazo Media and is a proud member of Tracks from PRX. To learn more about Tracks, visit tracks.fm. That's T R A X.fm. If you enjoy the show, ask your parents to subscribe to Timestorm on Google Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, or the Kids Listen app. A quick message for our adult listeners. Please be sure to check out our free resources, including episode guides and transcripts, over at timestormseries.com. And if you're interested in more bonus and behind-the-scenes content, we hope you'll consider joining our Patreon community over at patreon.com slash timestorm. You can also show your support for the series by sharing it with a friend or leaving a rating and review on Apple Podcasts or Podchaser. Timestorm is produced in Essex County, New Jersey, which is situated on the traditional territory of the Lenni Lenape people. 
As always, thanks for listening.